explain a situation that I get sometimes is that a lot of my recipes we use cake mixes. Actually, I love to use Duncan Hines. They're really a tried and true box of cake mix. Uh, but sometimes people will say, why aren't you using scratch recipes because they're so delicious. Well, in some cases that is true. but. My channel is all about sweet and simple, and I want to make life a little simpler for you. And I have just found over the years of being a baker that cake mixes work just fine, and it's super simple, and sometimes, in many cases, it's more inexpensive. Now, if you are a baker and you have all of these ingredients around your house, it's no big deal to walk through a scratch recipe. But if you're someone like my mom or my sister Kathy or many of my friends, and I know a lot of people out there with you, that you don't carry all of these things in your pantry. So let's say you need to make a cake, but you don't want to buy the flour and the sugar and the salt and the baking soda and the baking powder and the vanilla, but you have some eggs around, you have some butter or some oil, and you can just buy a box of cake mix and make a cake that's going to look and taste just like as if you did a scratch recipe. The other thing is one of the nice things, and you'll see this on my channel a lot, is that you take a box recipe that has all of these ingredients already in it, and then we complement on it. So you can add other ingredients to make it, give it more flavor. So I just wanted to explain to you that sometimes a cake mix can be a good option for you if you don't have all of the other ingredients around. So tell me what you think. You know, it's good to get everybody else's suge suggestions and their ideas. But I want to thank you so much for giving me the time to explain. Thanks so much for tuning into our channel. We are all about being simple. I want to get you out of the kitchen so that you can enjoy your family and friends. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and we'll see you next time.